Tonight, major developments in the fight against COVID-19. What we're learning right now is that Nevada will get more than 164,000 doses of the vaccine by the end of this month. Well, thanks for joining us here on TV. I'm Todd Quinones. And I'm Trisha Keen. That number is short of the number needed to cover those in the Tier 1 population. Let's get right to 13 Investigates reporter Joe Bartels live at UMC with the details for us. Joe. Yeah, Todd, Trisha, we know that hospital workers will be among the first in line to get the vaccine like those here at UMC. But as you said, it's not enough to cover everyone in the tier one group. That number around 173,000 folks statewide is identified by state authorities. Now, the Nevada Department of Health and Human Services tells 13 investigates more than 164,000 doses will be coming in this first go around once they are given emergency use authorization from the Food and Drug Administration. The FDA's vaccine committee is planning to meet next Thursday to review the Pfizer COVID-19 vaccine and then the following week they will meet and review the Moderna vaccine. Both have shown initial promise with a more than 90% effective rate with so far no serious side effects. A local researcher heading up the local trial study says this is the moment months in the making. It's one of the things I wake up every morning saying I'm going to work on a, a solution and that's the feeling of the patients who participated, the subjects who participated in the study. Uh, in the studies we're doing here. Now, both the Pfizer and Moderna vaccines require two doses spread between three or four weeks apart, depending on which vaccine people get. Reporting live, Joe Bartels, 13 Action News.